We have the frightening 911 call made by a man right after he was carjacked. A trio of Albuquerque cops would shoot and kill the suspect just minutes later, following a crosstown chase Saturday night. News 13's Jeff Todd is live in the newsplex with the details. No one knows what triggered Raymond Garcia's crime spree, but today, police played the 911 tapes that led to their deadly face off with Garcia. It was late Saturday night when Raymond Garcia threatened drivers outside a liquor store near 2nd and I-40, waving around this silver 38 caliber revolver. Garcia wanted a car, and police say he fired off a shot in the air to let everyone know he was serious. One driver tossed his keys into a field, so Garcia moved on to this man. Police were right around the corner. After stealing the pickup truck, Garcia led cops on a winding high-speed chase that ended outside a car dealership on Lomas near San Mateo. Police say Garcia pointed the gun at them, so all three officers fired away, killing him. Investigators say they found more ammo in his pocket and even more on the floor of the pickup truck. This afternoon, APD Chief Ray Schultz called Garcia a career criminal and said the shooting was clearly justified. The chief says he doesn't know if Garcia fired his gun at the officers, and he doesn't know how many times the officers fired back at Garcia or how many times Garcia was hit. This is APD's fourth fatal shooting this year. Jessica, back to you. Okay, Jeff, Raymond Garcia just got out of prison in April. He served about half of a six-year sentence for child abuse and assault.